channel. Today is a super exciting video. If you're wondering why I'm literally freaking out, so excited. It's because I'm going to my first dance convention this weekend. Well, actually, that's not true. I went to Dance Makers. I'm going to my first full weekend at a dance convention this weekend, and it's Nuvo. <laughs> it was part of my gift for my 16th birthday, but yeah, I can't wait. Anyway, besides the point, besides me being all extremely overexcited, this video I'm going to be packing for Nuvo, taking you guys with me to show you guys what I pack for a dance convention. So I'm not staying in a hotel, it's only an hour away, so we'll be driving up there, so I don't really need to pack like toiletries and everything, like all that. This is just my dance bag, what I'm gonna be actually bringing with me inside the convention i'll also be vlogging and i'm very excited hopefully i can get some footage i don't know i'll be pretty busy taking classes and stuff but make sure to stay tuned for that and yeah without further ado let's get right into the video so I have this list with me that I made a while ago because I've been excited for a while, guys. And I have a list of all the stuff that I need to pack, so we're just basically gonna pack together. I have my bag right here and it already has some stuff in it, but this is just an Adidas backpack that I got for $25 at like packsun.com. So if you're looking for a good dance bag, I would recommend this because I have lots of pockets. So what I already have in here is my shoes. So I'm gonna show you guys what shoes I pack. Starting off, I don't know if I wanna wear these or not because I don't wanna mess them up on the carpet floor but we'll see I might need them I have a couple contemporary fusion classes so it might be a ballroom style or it might be kind of like a heels class so I brought these heels that we wear for one of our group dances because I don't really have any higher heels that I want to wear also ballet flats I know I have like two or three ballet classes this weekend so that's gonna be fun then we have point shoes in case there's a point class I don't think there'll be one but I wanted to bring them just in case and for my feet I'm also gonna be packing my Apollo dance socks so these are like the nude color and we got these for me and Skylar duet but we never wore them so then I have these just plain black dance socks I have two pairs of them also one thing I forgot to grab a regular pair of socks just for tennis shoes and I'm also bringing these white tennis shoes white Nike tennis shoes for hip-hop shove them down in here somewhere Now I'm going to show you guys a couple miscellaneous items that I'm going to put in the same compartment. So this is a muscle roller. I like to shove that in there on the side. Also have my K&K Miami stretch band. I know I said I would do a review on this, but I haven't gotten a chance to yet. Then we have TheraBands. I think I'm only going to pack the black one. Yeah, I don't need the blue one. This is a TheraBand in case I need to warm up my ankles in the car ride or something. Next up, I have this little makeup bag that I got when I made a purchase at like Clinique or something. And because I have to wake up super early, I'm going to be doing my makeup in the car. So that's why I'm I packed all this makeup. So I'll just briefly show you guys what's inside. So I have a comb. I'm also gonna bring a brush. Dirty Beauty Blender, because those are the only ones I use apparently. Foundation, blush primer, Tarte eyeshadow, same one I used for homecoming. Eyebrow pencil, makeup brush, mascara, Carmex, eyeshadow, lip gloss, lipstick, bobby pins, and rubber bands because I'm gonna do my hair in the car as well. Hairnet in case I need to wear a bun. And yeah, that's basically it for what's in here. Before we get into the outfits, I'm gonna show you some other little things that I have in my pockets. I have these I take everywhere with me. I take this Cryoderm Pain Relief Gel, which works really good. And I also take this B12, which basically just um, gives you energy in case you are feeling like really tired or anything. Those are necessities for competition or convention for me. And in this front pocket, I'm probably gonna put snacks and stuff when I get them, but I have some money in it because I am going to Nuvo and I'm obviously gonna stock up on some merch, so. All right, now let's get into the fun part. These are my outfits. So I still haven't decided what I'm gonna wear, but I'll show you guys some of the outfits I'm gonna bring and some of the extra stuff that I'll be bringing. So I'm actually auditioning for Breakout Artist 2 just for fun because it's a good opportunity. So I still haven't decided what I wanna wear for that because I don't know if I wanna look cute or if I wanna stand out more, I don't know. So my first outfit maybe for day one are these plain black leggings. They're from Balance Collection. These are my favorite leggings ever. They're the best material ever. They're breathable and nice and thin. They are very good for the price I got them at. And then 
I'm bringing this Capizio kind of like ribbed green top and the back it has like a cool design so that's super cute. So I was thinking about wearing that for auditions or this kind of dark red zip up high neck leotard it has like a mesh back. These black tights over it when you stretch them out they get like see through. I don't know if I should wear this or if I should wear this. Comment below guys which one I should wear for auditions because this is really cute and flattering and then this one is red and it'll stand out so I don't know. Ah. Yeah, comment below which one I should wear. I'm packing those two outfits. I'm also bringing these shorts to maybe put over the red leotard for hip hop possibly. Then I have one more outfit that I could change into or wear instead of the other outfits, but I'm not sure. It's this black sports bra that is reversible to gray, but I'm gonna wear it black with these. Oh, the red Leo and the green top are both from Dance Work Corner. This is um, from Honeycut and they're these like blue fluorescent shorts that I would pair with this bra top and maybe for other classes wear this black long sleeve crop top over it. So that's also an outfit I'm considering. I mean, I'm really indecisive and I haven't picked what I wanna wear yet. So I'm just gonna pack it all. <laughs> then we have some extra little things. So, I mean, these are kind of outfits I might wear, I don't know. So next up I'm bringing a black leotard just in case I need to change into it for some reason or wear black clothes for whatever reason. This is the black leotard I wore in my last video. If you didn't see that, I'll put it up here in the corner. You can go watch, I taught myself a combo for Millennium Dance. I'm also gonna bring this flex leotard with the this cool back. I might bring one of those leotards. I'm also packing a pair of pink tights and tan tights in case I need those for classes or something. And for warm up pants, I'm bringing my trash bag pants that I normally wear everywhere. I also haven't decided if one day I should wear a black leotard with these pants or with these pants. I really don't know. Comment below. And for the car ride home, I'm bringing these star pants that are like sweatpants I got from Target that are really, really comfortable and soft. And this shirt from Festival of Dance, which is a little like dance intensive I went to. So that's what I'm bringing for clothes. I hope I can fit all that in there. I'm gonna figure that out later. I'm obviously gonna bring um, my camera, but I'm using it right now. And I'll probably bring some headphones too. So yeah, that's pretty much everything that I pack for a dance convention. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, um, make sure to comment below which outfit I should wear or which one was your favorite so I can know because I still have a little time before I'm leaving. So if you guys comment before I leave, maybe I could be wearing the outfit you pick. And yeah, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're interested because I'm definitely vlogging and if I get enough clips, it will definitely be a good vlog because I'm so excited. I can't believe I'm even going to Nuvo. I've been dreaming about going to Nuvo for like three years and I know it may not be a big deal to some people, but I'm really excited. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.